What's happening YouTube and welcome back to my channel. In case you're new here, me ni toa the comment it amjugu wake Papa Francis, mna nitafuta amnipati bana tuingie kwa story ambayo inazungumza sasa hivi na machozi imemtafuta bahati amepatikana leo bana. So today earlier in the morning, bahati mtoto wa mama stepped up na akafanya a press conference and he came out na akasema kwamba ile ticket alikuwa amepatiwa ya Jubilee ameweza kuambiwa aise rudisha ndio the incumbent anitangwa ni incumbent ama ni nini mp aweze kusalia pale na chama cha ODM tulikuwa pale bana uh, watu online media na niko na jamaa wangu wa nguvu hapa hivi kando alitoa presenter obai tumepatana leo tuweze kupiga because celebrities wameanza ku react to stories ndio obai yes, yes. na sasa tunataka ku analyze na the first one ameza sijui kama obai uko nayo tayari ni kutoka kwa the pluto now the pluto unajua kama ni mtu akwangi shai ku give his opinion na the pluto has already to reacted to this story na akasemaye eh ukiangalia pale kwenye mtandao wa instagram mm. uh, kwenye insta stories yake uh, the pluto anasema kenya si yetu tena yani unashinda fea na bado unaambiwa u step down na wenye party kweli kenya ina wenyewe kusema ina wenye kusema na akaposti video yako pale kwenye insta stories uh, ile ya bahati ya asubuhi ambayo tunaongelelea so anasema Kenya si yetu tena. Hey. Yeah, yeah, anasema kuna kuna wenyewe. Unaelewa? Kwa sababu kulingana na The Pluto anasema kwamba bahati ali ali win fairly, si ndio? Lakini wale wenye wali wananchi waliompigia wali kura uh, kulingana ile ni chama cha yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. So inasemekana kwamba tena wenye party wenyewe ndio wamekuja wanamwambia a step down. Unajua ingekuwa kama ni wananchi ungesema yenyewe hapa sina say ni, ni wananchi wanasema lakini kulingana na the, the, the Pluto anasema uh, official wa the party ambayo anasimama nayo wamemwambia aweze ku step down so wewe unafikiri vipi mtazamaji kuhusiana mambo kama hayo au sio yeah na alafu pia nimeona uh, another Kenyan celebrity amekuwa posted pale na nika video amefanya but atuko show hivi was reacting to bahati hatuwezi tukajua <laughs> lakini uh, ni video ambayo most people will say ame react to bahati because ile video style ameifanya nayo ni kama pia analialia sijui kama umepata mtu wangu <laughs> ni to speaking about jugush iko kwa eh ndio hiyo <laughs> tuweke audio tu tusikize tuweke audio and by links to my show guys jugush.ke i respect you the links on jugush.ke give it a chance alafu anaweka hizo emotions ni kama ni kama exactly what bahati was doing ama unaniaje yeah exactly unaona pia vinya anainua simu akionyesha hivi kwenye screen eh sawa Asa ya ba ile ya ba ilikuwa this is my certificate asa ne guys akisema kwamba ana respect pia yeah. lakini pia pale kwenye comment section naona pia watu wana react na, na emoji za kucheka yeah. kuna mmoja pale anasema ati if you don't get it forget yeah. about it yani ni kitu ambacho yeah. mtu mwenye akili anafaa kuwa ameelewa au sio yeah. mm It's Kenya bana people make memes. Eh hey, kwa link kwa, kwenye comment pia naona bahati amemeshoniwa. Ame so yeah. sijui ni hii video ilikuwa ya nini actually. Hizi yeah. tukajua intentions za Jugush yeah. zilikuwa ni. Ba, tuko na bahati yeah. kuna link yeah. for wenye tuli miss show. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah guys. Hebu tafuteni hiyo video ya Jugush muitazame alafu mkuje mcomment hapa kwenye comment kwenye comment section unajua jina yako ina comment comment section yeah au sio yeah but we are need to present you by so tumekuwa tukipitia reaction kutoka kwa the pluto of course the pluto inaonekana ana sympathize na bahati si ndio jugush always being a comedian once a comedian always a comedian bana so alafu pia i'm very sure tutaanza kuona challenges kama hizi ziki come through sana exactly 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 yeah anyway kenya is not a boring country mzee yeah sasa sasa hivi tutaona ma memes watu wameshikilia mabeseni ya kuoga sijui nini yeah, exactly wakitoa machozi pale na oh by way do you think kwamba bahati ile machozi alikuwa analia pale kuna watu wataanza kusema oh ilikuwa ni kipindi nini na nini but 
Uh, kwa zile nini tumeenda campaign na bahati huko Madhare yeah. zile tournament tumeenda na yeye huko Madhare you have seen the guy as pa, nini ako na ile passion ya watu wa Madhare so what do you think kuna watu wanasema labda ni kipindi analia si machozi kweli wewe ulionelea tulikuwa hapana as much as maze Kenya siku hizi entertainment imejaa makiki na nini wako na reason ya kusema ilikuwa kiki kwa sababu watu tunaamkia nini stories tofauti tunachukulia serious alafu mwisho anakuja wanasema ah ilikuwa kiki ilikuwa nini lakini kulingana na vinye nimeona bahati mimi sijaiona bahati akilia hivyo for real ilikuwa for the first time hata macho ilikuwa red kwa hiyo kwangu mimi niko 50 50 bado lakini ile machozi ilikuwa real na yeah kwa ground pia tumekuwa na bahati na tunaweza sema kwamba ya yeah, ako na ile passion ya kusafu watu wake wa madhari unaelewa na ako na uchungu kabisa uh, kama ni kweli ameambiwa step down na, na mambo kama hayo lakini uh, yote tisa uh, tunamtakia kila laheri kwa hii jani yake ya politics ambayo ameanzisha yes. okay mtongu huyu anaitwa president dubai go and subscribe to his youtube channel ni hivyo tu presenter ni wawili kuna presenter ali mwana light skin na kuna ubaya usijui ni mwana rangi gani <laughs> lakini tutashukuru je kufika of course kumbuka kusubscribe ndani ya comment 254 tunakutana in the next video